Hello guys, today we're gonna solve a question from HackerRank and the question name is company logo is difficulty level is medium maximum score is 30 and I'll give the question link in the description box so let's dig into the problem so the problem is uh, that a newly opened multinational brand has decided to base their company logo on, on a three most common characteristics in the company name they are now trying out various combination of company names and logos based on these conditions given a string s which is the company name in lower case letter you your task is to find the top three common characters in the string and uh, here is the input how they're gonna input and here's the output how it's gonna be shown and uh, uh, there are uh, there are three criteria. So, um, let's see. Let's uh, take uh, the first example for better understanding. Here you can see a string here, and it, as an input, and the output is like this: b3. Here b and three. Three means in the string three times this b was occurred, and a two means two times this a was occurred in the main string so we have to find out top three most used character in the string and sort them according to their prior and uh, in the, uh, if you see and the criteria is uh, if the occurrence count is in is the same sort the character in the alphabetical order it means that if the occurrence is equal uh, for example in this example here's the top three most used characters in the string and you can see the two is the second height or third height so in that case we have to sort the character according to their alphabetical order so it was sorted as a first then so let's jump on the code so here uh, we have to use a function called counter and uh, another thing, uh, it uh, this problem is in Python section. So I'm gonna use Python of this question. Uh, prop okay. Let's start. So I'm gonna import a module called collection from collection import counter. So here as so string has entered to here uh, in the s variable then we have to <coughs> count this using the counter function so i'll be make a z variable here. so let's just check with a a b b yeah it's showing uh, it's showing like this status occurrence status so here you can see a was occurred four times which is right b was occurred two times which is good which is right and right now we have to find top three most uh, used character so for that we have another uh, attribution of this counter function which is called greater common it's called a uh, most common so most underscore common three we're looking for three, top three so if i now run the program again we will see top three letters in this case we don't have third character third individual character we have we have only used a and b so let's uh, put some new string a r t and then check how it works okay so it has taken three elements according to their occurrence 
now uh, if we look at the third criteria that if the order is same then it will be occurred in in alphabetical order so at the top we can do one thing that if we can sort the take the input in ascending order then automate will be prioritized we sort the if the occurrence is same then automatically the sorting will be happen in alphabetical order so we have to input those thing in sorted way so there's an another function in python sort set this one this one is just uh, sorting the array okay so if we start the code again then what will see k here okay so here you can see k is uh, displaced um uh, if you look that k r t three of them has one occurrence uh then let's check it out by adding another special thing a a a let's go for g g g okay so uh you can see that a b c all of them are alphabetical order especially 3 and 3 these two are these two are sorted in alphabetical way so uh, if we now just put this g in front of the string then what happens then same thing will be happen as we have sorted after taking the input okay so uh right now we have a uh, close to our answer we get the answer but our answer is um our output should uh, shouldn't be shown in this way we have to show it like this way so to do that we can use star upper to star key in front of the my variable to cut off to cut off those braces list and uh, this comma and uh, i have to output those things by one line line by line to do that i can use uh, what to say i can use a loop to print line by line so for x in that and print will be that okay let's run it but this shouldn't be doing three times i have made a oh sorry make a silly mistake here i should be using x instead of that here which is giving me the output that i need now let's submit the code it has a pass tested it okay the problem was solved and i have earned 30 points so this is all about today's video hope you guys like this video this video and uh, if you want to see more of uh, more of these types of video please do like and subscribe to my channel for more problem solving videos thank you